Good afternoon, everybody. Steve Fletcher with a trumpet for my people, September 30th, 2021. And uh, I want to share this piece of information with you guys about La Puerta del Inferno. The, the Puerta del Infierno, the door of hell, the gate of hell. Okay, the gate of hell is going to be opening and on display on October 15th. 2021, the Inferno Exhibition, conceived by Jean Clare, will open at the Scuderi del Quirinale, and it will remain open until January 9th, 2022. This means Gate of Hell, Puerta del Infierno. Okay. On October 15th, 2021, the Inferno Exhibition, received by Jean Clare, will open at the Scuderi del Quirinale, remain open until January 9th, 2022. One of the most anticipated pieces is the plaster version of the monumental Gate of Hell by August Rodin. It is seven meters high. It was transported to Rome by the Coubertin Foundry in Paris with a special truck. The operation required an exceptional organizational effort at the Scuderi del Quirinale and the Door of Hell, which cost August Rodin 30 years of work and hosts 186 characters, the group of Count U Ugolini, Ugolino is on the right door, Paola and Francesca are on the left, Dante appears seated in the center of the upper band and will be the model of the famous thinker. Okay, this is where the inspiration came from Dante's Inferno. Okay, <clears throat> this is the Gate of Hell. That's going to be on display by sculpture artist Auguste Rodin. Okay. And this goes on to say, Rodin thought of a monumental portal more than four and a half meters high, covered with bas reliefs, inspired by Dante's hell, Dante's inferno. <clears throat> okay. Now, what is the... Kiranal uh, Palace. It's going to be on display at the Kiranal Palace. This is the official residence of the president of the Italian Republic. Okay. So they're going to be putting on display the gates of hell. Okay, the gates of hell. And it's going to be on display at the uh, Italian Presidential Palace. And uh, this is coinciding with the same day that October 15th, Italy's workers will need green pass from October 15th. So on the day that Italy goes mandatory with the vaccination, they're opening La Puerta del Infierno. Okay. I've shared with you on my channel why we're watching October 24th as the day of the flood. And we're watching seven days before that. Chess Van 10, coinciding with October 15th, 16th, and 17th as a seven-day warning. Well, they're going to be opening the gates of hell here on the 15th of October. The gates of hell. Okay. Connected together with an obligatory green pass vaccination passport. Okay. On the day that Noah entered the ark, they're opening the Puerta del Infierno on the day that Noah entered the ark. Okay. Could this be a, some type of a coincidence? What does the Bible say about the gates of hell? Matthew 16, 17 through 19. Jesus answered and said unto him, Blessed art thou, Simon Barjona, for flesh and blood hath not revealed it unto thee, but my Father which is in heaven. And I say unto thee that thou art Peter, and upon this rock I will build my church, and the gates of hell shall not prevail against it. They want to construct the gates of hell on October 15th. The gates of hell will not prevail against the church of Jesus Christ. And I will give unto thee the keys of the kingdom of heaven, and whatsoever thou shalt bind on earth shall be bound in heaven, and whatsoever thou shalt loose on earth shall be loosed in heaven. 
God has given us the keys to the kingdom. The gates of hell shall not prevail against the church of Jesus Christ. So they can do whatever they want, but they will fail. The gates of hell will fail. They will fall. And God will be victorious in the end, even though great tribulation is on the way. So this is what I wanted to share with you guys. I pray you're blessed. I'll leave all links for you in the description box. This is Steve Fletcher with a trumpet for my people. The sign of his coming revealed.